Guys and girls, those of you that follow the bronze pack method, you guys, I tell you what, you guys are in for a treat today. We've got two, not one, but two brand new league SBCs. We have the Pro League from the Belgian League and we have the Liga BBVA Mexican League. And I tell you what, there are some spicy cards up for grabs here. Amuzu or Okariki, both absolutely rapid with great dribbling, decent shooting. Uh, not much else. So they're looking like very, very good potential super subs. Don't know their weak foot, and that we'll dive into that in a second. Uh, it's 16 teams for the Pro League. It'll probably cost you quite a bit to start with. Everyone's going to be panicking. But here, like Circle of Bruges, you only need seven players. 11. 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11. So, okay, it's like one team uh, where you don't need 11, which is Circle of Bruges. We'll dive into this on, uh, on stream on Twitch. So if you guys do enjoy the Bronze Pack method, come over to the Twitch channel. Come and watch us do it all live. What packs are we getting? Small Rare Mixed, Premium Electrum, Small Rare Silver, Small Premium Electrum, Small Prime Gold. Okay, these packs are looking quite good. Quite a lot of mixture of good silvers and uh, some half-decent gold. Nothing nothing crazy on that one there for the gold. Uh, the Mexican League, you've got a choice between Camilo and Pabon. Again, both looking like really, really good uh, super subs, potentially. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it's an interesting day. What sort of ones are we going to get here? So we've got small gold, jumbo silver. Okay, so again, we're looking at very similar packs. Nothing looking like it's going to be crazy. Uh, a couple of small rare silvers, which is quite nice. Nothing absolutely off the chart with these. But um, Amuzu and Okariki, let's have a little look and see. I mean, obviously none of these are going to fit into my team. But Amuzu and Okariki, uh, both looking like they could be quite nice cards. Let's have a quick look and see how good Amuzu is. Also, if you've never watched any of my Bronze Pack Method videos, please do check them out on the channel. Uh, Amuzu, four star, five star weak foot. Ooh, okay. 5'7", 99 agility and balance. Holy moly. 99 acceleration with 90 sprint speed. Finishing and composure is lacking a little bit. Passing is not great. If you're going to start him in a team, good luck. Um, also, definitely get a dead eye on him for that shooting and passing boost. Dribbling's really good. Apart from his reactions, you can't really boost composure. Defending and physical is a bit pointless, but he does have 99 jumping. Nothing to write home about there. Um, was it... What was the last guy called? Was it Ok Okariki? Okariki, I think I've got this right. Hey, Okariki. He is four star, four star. Wow. Okay, he's got flare trait. Uh, what was he? It's five foot 11. Jeez, 99 agility as well. 88 composure with the 94 finishing. 94 acceleration with 96 sprint speed. So he actually has 95 pace. Uh, don't be fooled by that. Long shots are pretty bad, so are volleys. Pens don't matter too much. Uh, again, if you're going to use his long passing, I'll tell you what, his passing is shocking. 91 vision and 94 short pass, but he's got 53 curve and only 44 long pass. Does have 99 jumping and 99 heading. It's a shame that heading's not that great this year. He looks like a nice card, though. He looks like a very nice card. Uh, another player we can look at was Pabon, who looked really good. Uh, let's see how good his card looks. Again, he's only, he's only three star, four stars. He's probably the worst out of the lot so far. Really fast again, though. Low finishing, average composure. 96 strength stands out, though. Great dribbling stats again, though. Shot power is fantastic. Really good pace. He's an okay kind of card. Uh, and the last one, I think, was Camilo, if I remember rightly. Let's have a little look at Camilo. I'm assuming it's this guy. Uh, he's Again, he's got good pace. Only 90 pace. Don't get fooled again. Good jumping stands out. Good agility stands out. He's five foot seven high low. That's quite good for a striker. He is four star, four star as well. Good agility, good balance, good ball control. Finishing 88, uh, composure 86 is really, really good as well. Power free kick, but he is injury prone. Not that matters too much. Uh, he's actually a really good free kick taker. Uh, 89 curve and 80, uh, sorry, 96 accuracy is quite good. Uh, shot power is 96 as well. So he could be quite a good free kick taker, actually. Uh, but again, maybe a good super sub. Let me know if you guys have been enjoying the Bronze Pack series so far. I might start doing more updates with it. Um, these guys do look pretty good. Two brand new leagues. Also, we've got the bronze and silver upgrades that have come out. They're only out for two days at the time of the video coming out. So do be aware, uh, do be aware of those. You get the extra silver and the extra bronze player in each pack. But yeah, these two league SBCs looking really good. I'll try and get you some pricing updates on them very soon once they come out. But yeah, smash the thumbs up if you're enjoying the bronze packs. If you are getting involved with these leagues, do let me know who you're going to pick. Do you like the players? Comment down below, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you soon.